Hey guys, I got a new video for you today, and this is actually going to be on the knife that I won uh, in the contest that John Wayne Colt 45 was doing for hitting a thousand subscribers. Uh, congratulations to John Wayne Colt 45 for hitting a, a thousand subscribers first and foremost, and also uh, thanks for uh, you know hosting this uh, this great contest. Um, if you guys didn't catch it, what he was doing is he had uh, I believe it was five knives um, to give away. And the way that he did it, um, I think that was it was very ingenious, is um, you had to make a video response and you had to say which knife you wanted to be put in a drawing for and why or what you would use it for. Um, that was really cool because it kind of narrowed your chances. Um, it gave you, I, I should say, it gave you a better chance to win um, because you, you know, there was fewer people competing for each knife. Now the way he did it is um, he went ahead and drew names. And unfortunately, the knife that I wanted to win, um, I didn't win. But uh, to everybody's surprise, he did a consolation prize. And he, what he did is he took all the um, all the people that didn't win and in any of the other drawings, stuck them all together in lunch in the lunchbox, shook it up, and pulled out a name, and it just so happened to be my name. And oddly enough, it was actually the knife that I had actually originally put in to win. So. You know, I was very surprised and very happy that that, that actually happened. Um, again, thanks for John Wayne Cold, Cold 45 for having that contest. Um, you know, and, and I got this today. I'm sorry, I was kind of excited and I opened it up. I couldn't do the unboxing uh, on camera. But I have the knife here. Um, and as you guys can see, this is uh, Magnum by Boker. Um, and the knife that I won was the Boker Reflection 1. And... You know, when I saw it in the video, it automatically caught my eye. Um, I just really liked the the, uh, the color combination that, that I saw on there. And when I got this and opened it up and saw it with my own eyes, I was glad that I put it in for this one and that I actually won this one. This knife is really, really nice. I mean, I'm, I'm hoping the colors come out on camera, but it's got these uh, these translucent colors um, through, through the handle right here. It look really nice. It has it over here also. Um, you know, uh, through through the handle up here, um, it has it, it all the way in the back as well. It's a really heavy knife. Um, you know, it's a uh, 4.6 ounces, and I actually had to look up some of the specs to to be able to give you the uh, the accurate information. But really, really beefy knife. I like I like big knives, so obviously, you know, I'm I'm, I'm loving this knife. Um, it's uh, overall it's stainless steel, so you know, obviously, you can you can see that you know it's. Uh, all the way through, uh, and it's true what he said. the the pocket uh, The pocket clip rides really, really low uh, in the pocket. I was testing it out when I got it, and um, you know I really like that. Uh, the only uh, The only thing that I don't like is um, that the way that the the pocket clip is designed, um, it almost makes it seem like it's a left handed knife, just because the blade sits out. Normally, this the blade would sit towards your pocket if it was a right handed knife. So, um, you know, obviously not, not a big deal, but just, you know, something to kind of get used to. Um, the blade opens up really, really nice, and the lockup is really, really good. Um, this is actually a, uh, a frame lock. Um, I don't have too many of these, so I'll, that's another plus on this knife right here. But really, really thick frame, as you guys can see there, and it locks really, really nice. Um, uh, dual thumb studs on there uh, to open it up, and the blade design is really, really nice. Um, definitely makes for uh, for a great EDC knife. Uh, this is uh, 440 stainless steel and the blade is actually 3 and 3 8 uh, inches so a um, little bit to the larger side um, of EDC knives but you know obviously you know definitely you know very useful. Uh, it's got some great jimping right up here um, and you know it fits the hand really really nice. Now um, I, I would almost say it's a shame to use this knife um, for every day just because of you know just how nice it really looks so this is probably going to be something that I'm just gonna you know maybe hold off uh, and, and use it for special occasions or something you know um, maybe carrying it when uh, you know when I'm wearing you know slacks or something like that just to kinda you know show off the uh, those really really nice colors through there the translucent colors through the uh, through the blade itself now I have um, you know by way of comparison I've got my um, Benchmade full-size Griptilian here so you guys can see um, you know just uh, frame of reference uh, pretty pretty similar size to the uh, to the griptilian um, also pretty similar blade shapes so you know 
a lot of you guys know what the uh, Grutillion looks like and feels like, so obviously a little bit heavier, but um, as far as, uh, you know, the weight and, you know, obviously not the weight, but as far as the size of it, you know, and blade and all that, it's it's very similar. Really, really nice, uh, nice blade there. Let me see if I can show that off where it says, uh, it's got, you know, Magnum right there on the blade, Division of Boker, and then uh, China on the other side. But, um, great, great knife. Um, you know, I can't thank John, John Wayne Colt 45 enough for, uh, for giving me the opportunity uh, to win this and uh, you know just a uh, great guy check out his channel if you guys haven't um, you know he's got some really really good information on knives and I uh, uh, just wanted to make this video to let everybody know that I got it um, and to let John know that I got it also and uh, I, I, I really enjoy it alright guys let me know if you have any questions thanks